I'm doing this a little early because I have a telehealth uh, appointment with my doctor at 9 o'clock. And those are hard to get, so um, I am doing this a little early. And I was switched with Reverend Carla for yesterday. So uh, I am going to kind of do the prayer that I had written for yesterday because I, it really resonated with me. I've been um, taking a class with Reverend Richard Rogers and it was called The Big Leap and I think it's going to be transformational in my life but when I saw this um, I reflect the light of God in the daily word yesterday it made me think of the song that we have sung quite a bit that Aaron McGong written from Seattle Unity Church wrote um, I am the radiant life of God I am I am I am and I love that song uh, because it talks about a lot of different things uh, I am the vim and vigor, the vitality, the love, the joy, the peace, um, the power of God, all of those things. And we all are. We are all are a reflection of God and God's light. And all of those things really make up this light. And we, we really are God's light bearer. And we radiate that light out into the world. And the more we are centered in spirit, the more we can radiate out that light and um, reflect that light of God, because we are the light of God. We really are, each one of us as an individual and collectively as a group. Like next week, there is the World Day of Prayer, which starts on Wednesday evening and goes through, um, or Wednesday late afternoon and goes through Thursday till about one o'clock. That's the World Day of Prayer, and that is a time where the collective light shines and really makes a difference. So we each have our own little light to shine, but we as a group, as, as people, um, as humans having a, a, a physical experience, but we're actually spiritual beings, we have that opportunity to shine. And so let's go within and what I would like you to do is, is just take a moment and listen to what spirit might be speaking to you, but more than that, soak in that light. It's like we're going to plug in a battery, uh, plug about a charger. We're plugging into a charger. So let's charge ourselves with the radiant light of God. Breathe three or four times in and out. Now, let's just feel that radiant light of God. The light of God. The love of God. The power of God. Just radiating within us. Look in that battery and let's just feel in quiet. We will take in that light. So when we come out of this silence, we will be charged up and ready to radiate that light outward.
feel that light. Feel that light of God radiate through you into your spiritual center. Making you light in spirit and light as in glowing. Now let's come to the now. Open your eyes and realize that your job today is to radiate and reflect the light of God. You radiate it from within and you reflect it to others. You reflect it out into the world. It radiates from your core, your spiritual core. You are the light of God. I am the light of God. We are the light of God. We can radiate just flowingly. And regardless of the outward circumstances, like today, it's going to be hot. It doesn't matter. We can still shine. Shine within. Shine within and shine out to others. So I have three meditation affirmations for you today. I reflect the light of God. I reflect the light of God. I reflect the light of God. That's part of our job. I am the light of God. I am the light of God. I am the light of God. And the last one is, I am the radiant life of God. I am the radiant life of God. I am the radiant life of God. I am, I am, I am. Because you are radiating God's light out into the world. And you help others by radiating your life through kindness, through compassion, through love, through caring, through understanding. All those ways and in all ways, you are the radiant life of God. Have a wonderful Thursday, tremendous Thursday. And please, please try to keep cool.